The current situation in the longline fishery is that it's basically been banned in the Gulf of Mexico. The ruling was put in place to protect turtles. And unfortunately, it's having a pretty devastating effect on the Cortez fishery. Most of the boats that work out of Cortez are longline boats. They're trying to use the new gear, which is based, not new gear, but the gear they're trying to use is bandit gear. And they're not doing very well. They're catching less than 2,000 pounds per trip, which is really hurting AP Bellfish Company, where I work, and Starfish Company, which relies on AP Bellfish Company to provide the grouper that we sell here to the tourist. So I think with the supply going down, it means the price is either going to go up or possibly not even be available. With even the economy, the economy being down, people are still coming out here and, and buying seafood because it's such a beautiful location and the food's really good. But one of our main sellers is grouper. Therefore, this is, it's kind of scary for me because not only is AP Bell reliant on that, those grouper landings, so is Star. So I, I don't know what, what, what's going to happen. I can't stand the thought of selling anything imported through here because we kind of specialize on native fish. I mean, that's what we do here, mullet, grouper, shrimp. Everything is produced in the Gulf of Mexico or our local bays or from those areas. And um, I, I don't know what we're going to do. It's kind of scary.